Hello everyone, my name is Guforyu and welcome back to Let's Play Spate. Now, uh, we are starting a little bit before uh, the last uh, point uh, I left off from the other video and that kind of sucks because that means I have to deal with this whole thing all over again. But that's okay, because we know now no, I can do it. So let's let's get this done. All right, just gotta watch it. Gotta watch it. All right, I'm I'm paranoid, so I'm gonna wait. Okay, go and oh, oh, and that landed right on my head. All right, okay. So I'm an idiot. Anyways, uh, I have no words for that. I don't know what I did there. So, um, I wanted to get this video, um, done, um, good lord, it seems like I'm doing worse than I was doing before, like, this is really, really bad. So, I was hoping to get this video done, uh, before my medicine kicks in, um, which, that would be absolutely delightful. Aha! I actually beat this thing a lot easier than the last time. Sweet! Alright. The absinthe is burning through me now. I'm quickly reminded of why I drink absinthe. It's the only thing I have left that makes me feel alive. A tiny spark of what things once were. What they used to be. Is that really such a bad thing to want? Okay, uh, does that mean that I should be continuing to drink? Oh, what are you? Um, hello, you seem calm for having run into a giant creature with horns. I, yeah, I wouldn't be so calm. You think so? It's easy being calm when you know that what you're seeing is not real. Ah, yes, right. You think I am just an illusion caused by that little drink of yours. I suppose you don't think the man in the tower is real either. Man in the tower? Nobody. Here, if I'm not real, then I imagine you could probably just walk right through me. Uh, sh should I attempt to walk through? I guess that was a challenge. Challenge accepted! Ha! That tickles. Okay, obviously you weren't real. Okay, well, no two ways about it. That was weird. Yes, that was weird indeed. Oh, and we're transitioning. Or was that just another blackout? I think it was another blackout. I don't know. So I'm wondering if the blackouts are a save mechanism in this game. Um, I'm going to assume so because this save actually took place like right after the first blackout so hello I am robot it's nice to meet you yeah I know we've already met buddy oh right right you're the guy from Egypt that likes spaghetti and juggling no no that's that's I have no a clue who that is I swear I can speak English oh have you seen a man come by here? Chubby fella in a suit? Nope, haven't seen him. Will you be my friend? Oh, he's so pitiful. He just wants to friend. Sorry, buddy. I like being alone with my drink. Plus, I'm too busy investigating a disappearance to be making friends. Oh, come on! The robot's cute, and he can help. Okay, have a nice day. Oh, look at his face. He's so pitiful. Guy's such a douche. No, well, that could have been really useful, especially in this situation. 
I mean, just think about it. Having like that awesome, ro that awesome robot just helping you. Kind of My daughter. She was a ball of energy. My ex-wife had a good way of putting it. Spirited. She was a spirited little girl. Okay, so I've got two ways to go here. I'm gonna go down and see what's down here first. Whoa! Okay. Oh, uh, whoa, okay. One touch of the spikes and you go bye-bye. Uh, okay, okay, run, 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 go, go, faster, 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 faster. Okay, I got through. Okay. Well, I couldn't find a whole lot on this businessman. It's not like he was a square. He didn't seem the type to run the straight and narrow. Perhaps he got caught up into something. Something bad. Something ugly. Alright, so we know that the bottom goes through. I kind of want to... Oh, God. Uh, uh, oh, wow. So that's what happens with that. I'm going to... Oh, jeez. I'm going to go back and... Wow. That was too close. Too close, too close. I'm having way too many close moments for comfort. I'm gonna go back up to the top just to see, just to see if I missed anything. Because if I know anything about video games, it's that there's a path divergent. More than likely, there's. Oh. Let me thank you, Lightning. That's one very strange-looking tree. see something etched into the side of the tree. It reads, Robot Love Lamp. <sighs> oh, God. Robot... That robot loves lamps. I wonder... Um... Whoa. Okay. I see my daughter. Apparently, the tree doesn't really change so much for that. Uh, can't really go any higher. Uh, if anybody was wondering why that happened, obviously, I took a drink because something told me that. I needed to take a drink at that moment. I figured, why the hell not? <laughs> um, yeah, considering if he's supposed to be a recovering alcoholic, that is rather counterproductive. I don't know. I'll be sure to uh, completely lay out my complete. Oh, oh god! Thank you for completely. My train of thought. <sighs> Anyways, uh, I'll be sure to lay out a complete uh, video of my thoughts and feelings, um, sort of a reaction to this entire playthrough of video game uh, in a separate video for you guys. Gonna take a ride, gonna take a ride, take a ride with me. Gonna take a ride, fly to the sunset. Oh gosh, I almost fell. Alright, oh, please. Oh, thank God. I was about to say, don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Boing. Alright. Yay! It's these things of flying. Fly like an eagle. Okay. Now we're two. Um. Oh, I see it. Alright. 
Geronimo! Sweet! I caught it. Now fly my ass over to the next platform. Make sure I land on it so I don't die. Alright, cool. Oh gosh. Uh, yeah. Okay, that was that was my fault, guys. I, all right. Oh no 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 no. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm an idiot. Christ. Come on. No. 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 Oh God. Damn it. Come on, come on. Fuck, 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 fuck. fuck. Right in the back of the head. F oh. Fuck. Alright. Alright. Damn it. Alright, there we go. And slide down for good measure. Jeez. Alright, here we go. And another blackout. And the music changed up. That's that's lovely. Does that what do? All right, so it's rolling down, it's falling off. Oh, okay, I see what's going on here. Hit this, drops down. I gotta drop down here. Go, 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 run. All right, I see this. So I get on here. Wait for the boulder to come and drop down, and up I go. Sweet! Thank you. Whoa. That's trippy. Kind of reminds hey, me. Hey, floating stones. That's something you don't see every day. Probably just the drink giving me more reason. Uh, this guy. This guy talks about his drink a lot, and I'm I'm noticing a theme here. Every time the camera zooms out in this sort of fashion, generally, I feel like that is a cue for me to take a drink because there's something hidden here that they want me to see, but I'm not going to see it whenever I'm sober. Now, the question is, to drink or not to drink? That is the question. Uh, okay. Okay, everything started spinning. Uh, I'm not sure what the point of that was, but okay. These flags remind me of the first date I ever went on with my wife. Boy, was she a looker. It was a blind date. I met her at a little cafe on the water. It was a windy day. I made my way around the corner and the first thing I saw was her hair. Dancing with the wind. For me, it was love at first sight. For her, well, for her it was just sight. <laughs> Pretty sure I just saw my daughter once again. Uh, 
I love the graphics. The graphics in this game are very, very interesting. As I made my way up the bridge, I could see that something wasn't right. It was the businessman's steamship. It was parked, running idle. I could see a slumped form crumpled over a crate. You could tell the life had run out of him. Okay, the backstory narration. Sorry, uh, I'm a motor mouth. <laughs> Uh, I completely lost my train of thought, so we're just gonna assume that I was on something nondescript and unimportant. Robot, what happened here? All I know is that he shot himself. I saw it. Uh, okay. Sure, the robot's a nice enough fella and all, but there's something he's not telling me. It's very clear that this man did not kill himself. Hell, there ain't even a murder weapon nearby. This robot is hiding something. You're telling me that this man killed himself? Yes, it's true. Robot, come on. It's clear that this man did not kill himself. Uh, anybody picking up some iRobot vibes? Who did this to him? Does it... What, uh, what does it matter? You solved the case. You should go now. Okay. This robot just got all sorts of crazy suspicious. Do you know of a man in a tower? There is no man in that tower. Here, I can help you load this man into a boat so you can head back to the city. You're awfully quick to try to get me off of this island. No thanks, robot. This doesn't smell right. But you can leave now. The case is over. Sorry, buddy. I gotta push on. Alright. Uh, robot's still, still pretty cute, but now I'm, like, uber suspicious of him now. I know what you're thinking. I already found the missing businessman. What the hell am I still doing in the X-Zone? It ain't exactly the happiest place on Earth. The skinny of it is, is that I've got nothing to lose. And there are too many unanswered questions. Is there a man in the tower? Is he the one that killed the businessman? Why is he here? Could he be connected to all those disappearances ten years ago? Does this robot really love lamps? I wanted all these answers. And my flask was still half full, not half empty. <laughs> Okay, all those are really great questions to point out, except for the, why does, does the robot really love lambs? Why do I care? <laughs> the robot really likes lambs, and, and to each their own, you know, to each their own, I don't, I don't care, you know, you love lambs. But every other question, though, seemed very valid. Okay, so we gotta, oh god, Whew. We got a dilapidated ruin system here. Looks like an old skyscraper. Let's see here. So jump. Jump two times. Jump. Jump two times. I feel like I could totally make a song out of this. Jump two times. Jump two times. What the flippin' hell? Okay, it's a giant fish. I don't know what possessed me to take a drink to that, but... Yeah. That was weird. Okay, whoa. Fall down, jump, jump. Alright, so, let's recap. We found the millionaire, or billionaire. Even here, in this hell on earth, this wretched rain, I wish my daughter was with me. She had a way of making everything brighter. She died some years back. I used to bring her here with my wife. Those were better days, brighter days.
It seems fitting now that the only thing I bring with me this time is a drink. That's all I have left. And it fits this vile place well. Alright, so, quick recap. We found the billionaire, millionaire, whatever he is. He was dead, apparently killed. Oh, died. I need to jump from there. Uh, actually, I think I'm going to leave this video off here. So, uh, again, quick recap. We found the millionaire, billionaire, whatever the hell he is. Uh, dead. Not sure if suicide, not sure if murder. Gonna go on the assumption that it was a murder. There was no murder weapon around. There was no suicide weapon around. So, that being said, we are pressing on further into the X zone to answer unanswered questions. Like the disappearance of the many people ten years ago in this game, supposedly. Um... Also, what is that robot hiding? Is there really a man in a tower? As that creature from earlier that we walked through who was apparently ticklish said. So many questions that need to be answered. So many things that are very weird and just sort of drawing in. We also learned a little bit more backstory on the character. His uh, daughter died some years ago. And his wife left him shortly thereafter, and therefore that's why he turned into a drunk. I am also very counterproductive in that I keep giving him drinks whenever apparently he's supposed to be recovering, or that's what it says on the game page. I don't know. It doesn't really seem like he's trying to recover, but I digress. I am babbling. Thank you guys so much for joining me in this playthrough. I very appreciate it very, very much. Please leave a like, a comment in the box below. Um, again, the game link is uh, in the description below as well. Uh, this playthrough is probably going to run on uh, quite a bit in terms of a series of videos. So this will be my first truly long Let's Play, and I'm very, very excited to have you guys along for the journey. So again, thank you very much, and I hope you have a pleasant day. Namaste.